Yo, welcome back to my first playthrough of Red Dead Redemption 2 on Xbox. Uh, epilogue 1, and uh, we're playing for this mission. It's called Jim Milton Rides Again. David Geddes, our boss, as we're a rancher, farmhand. See if I can go in this building. No. What about this way. Hi, fellas. Mister. Pardon. Air tastes different out here, don't it? Is that so? Why the country? Fill those lungs, huh? See you soon. Just thinking. Maybe our problems aren't all that bad, huh? Should. Sure. Have a good one. Here we are. We'll be seeing you. Full of such beautiful things. See ya. I just can't get in there. The reason why I like to look in these places because you know we've got those card sets. So usually they're in most accessible buildings. No, I'm not, not going to break the lock while we're here. See if we can get up in the house. Keep the dogs sweet so it don't go mad. There's a rifle there, in case we need it. Any other ways in? Yeah, my moral compass is saying don't break that door lock in that previous building. But we will at some point, I'm sure of it. But anyway, let's carry on with this mission, or start it if that. Mr. Geddes? Hey, I heard we had another incident with the uh, Laramie boys. Yeah, there was an... Well, they mean to scare me. Are you scared? A little. I've got a lot invested in this place, and, and not just the land, but, but my family. It's, yeah. Uh, it's hard to explain. I understand. I'll do my best to keep you safe, sir. Uh, I know you will. So how's your family? Uh, just fine. I should probably head back. <laughs> yeah, I know how it is. <laughs> How'd you get on? Okay, I guess. Better? Sure, I'm just tired. I know. Anybody want some more? Mm. Uh, no, 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 I'm thank good. You. I miss Mr. Pearson. John Marston, you're such a pig! <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's getting late. Let's get some rest. That was a joke. He was basically uh, night, slagging Jack. off her cooking. Good night, <laughs> Good night, Jack. Good night, Pa. Wonder if we ever get to find out what happened to Pearson and Strauss and what are you, what are you doing? Mary Beth. My job, Abigail. Lock this door behind me. Don't open it unless you know it's. Yeah, we're going out in a onesie. Oh shit! Jim, you gotta do something. Two of them by the stall. That Tom. Three. Who's this? Who's this? New hand. Where's Kenny? I'm in business, motherfucker. They've killed Mr. Tobert! Oh, fuck! You men okay? 
I think so. Yeah. Jim Milton saved my life. It's Mr. Abel. Yeah, of course, it's Mr. Abel. I can't believe he thinks it can scare me out of here. Then I guess we're getting your cattle back, I guess sir. we are. Can you go too, Tom? Of course, sir. All right, Jim. I know you can handle yourself. A little. Go get your guns and head out. Guns? Oh, don't play coy with me, son. We need your help. I don't care what you used to do or what your, your, your name is. This is the land of second chances. Understood. Okay. Come in. It's me. What was it? Mr. Getty's cattle was taken. I'm sorry to hear that. What are you doing in that thing? Mr. Getty's been real good. Hey. We. I. What are you doing? My job, Abigail. My oh, that's job. not my pistol. That's just some lame one. Those rifles are mine because they've got the wraps on them. Let's have a little. Oh, it's got the old skull offers. We've got everything. But oh no, no, John's Catman revolver. Or just a normal one. I haven't got my ammo though. I've got a Schofield. Just got a couple of basics. Carbine repeater, repeating shotgun. Good. Let's go. This is gonna be the last we hear out of them. Yeah. Yeah! Right! This is my, my repeater, alright. The one I had with Arthur. Oh, why is it? Oh, it's just here. Might be an ambush. Off your horses here. We'll be better on foot. Fuck okay. yeah. If you say so. Actually, that isn't my repeater, because my repeater That's has a scope on it. Head. There's our cows. I'll have to check that scope field as well. I think it's a basic one. A couple more around the side, I imagine. Let's get a closer look. Let's go. So I think what we've got is just basic weaponry, but when he pulled the case yeah. out from under the bed, it was my rifle because it had the wraps on it. I'm gonna head straight in. Yep, Tom. You head up there and try and give us some cover. Abe, you're gonna try and flank the place and come in from the back. I'll give you a minute or two, then I'm heading in. Yes, sir. Okay. Hey! Hey! You boys been coming up to Pronghorn? I thought I'd come down here. You're all so tough! That was stupid of me.
see you, Milton. You're go Where are you, big fella? You jump down on us. There he is. Come on, John. Oh shit. You know that woman of yours got the look of a woman ain't had a real ride in her life. She's gotta make do with some piss poor stinking farmhand. Hey, hey, tell her I'll let her in my seats. Long as she <laughs> Have a good looky looky, tell you what we want. So we got weapons upstairs, let's go have a look. Looks like we should just walk out the doors, but uh Oh that was Arthur's hat as well. Yeah, I ain't losing that mate. Sentimental value my son. What we got here? Don't really need weapons to be honest. I'd say because I'm sure we've got all of Arthur's gear. Let's just jump down and loot some bodies. to loot because we ain't got the dough that we used to have with Arthur. We should get all these bodies and uh, put them in the barn and set the barn on fire. Or just uh, put the bodies on a pile of hay because we should take ownership of this land now. least expected that counter attack I'd say oh we got items laying around as well which is cool There's a weapon somewhere here. I can't see the fucker. Alright, look for a few items. Definitely loot that house. Got some snacks for me? Too kind. Way too kind. Cut more bodies to loot. But that was coffee on there.
Plenty of goods to pick up, look, bodies everywhere. This is what uh, we learned from Arthur. Gonna miss that guy. You know, he, for all we know, he died on, on that hilltop. So I don't know if we'll ever find him again. calling the horse over because what I want to do is I want to check when I pick up another gun that we actually keep it but I do hope we get Arthur's weapon load out, out again because you know all my guns were completely uh, customised especially my revolvers and my Schofields Shotty. Let's see if there are Peters on the horse. Yep, so whatever we pick up stays there, which is really good. So what we would do, we'll holster... ...any rifles, so we can... Uh, ...pick up any other pistols that are around. small bit of salute but you know it's enjoying I find it enjoyable going around looting even if it's small items you know especially at this point in the game where we're basically starting over again in a way so pick up what we can stack up what we can don't even have to pick up a card you usually just pick up packs of cigarettes well I remember I've not as Arthur there were so many buildings I went in that had cigarettes but I couldn't pick them up because I already had some but I forgot about uh, you know the cards that were in them so really I probably should have had like all if not all the cards already as Arthur you know I wonder if we have to wait till we complete the whole epilogue before we get to free roam and do what we want. I mean, we could now, you know, but we we're not really equipped for it. Outfits-wise, with the different weathers, you know. Weapons, especially upgraded ones, you know. If we're going to hunt some more animals, fish... Or any uh, shootouts, we want to make sure we got all the best shit. Right, we still got upstairs to do, which is good. Oh, we got a nice cleaver. Nice. Oh, nice. Very nice. Crime pays in Red Dead. I think we have to 
close it if we want to open that other one. Oh no, it's a door. What am I doing? Alright, upstairs we go. This is just one little building, really. Tons of stuff in here. some stuff here a Litchfield repeater yes please Load of cash here, how much? Oh, god damn. Definitely you could do with that. Yeah, I gotta totally keep remembering if we ain't got any space for cards, what we need to do is smoke the ones we've got. Where is it? Yeah, premium cigarettes. should really have all the cards I didn't realize you had to like smoke the cigarettes to get rid of them to then be able to pick up the new packs with the, all the new uh, cards in surprised the uh, lawmen aren't out here yet usually if you play in the uh, Like, I've been this Arthur. I don't know whether we've done a mission or just had a massive shootout. And if you stay there too long, obviously the law are notified somehow. Litchfield and a, and a Springfield. Oh, I totally forgot about this chest. How could I forget? And there was nothing in there, unfortunately. is it? Is that explosive? Finally, I think it's time to leave this shithole. Let's go, girl. There you go, we still got everything. Which is lovely. Nice little loadout. Let's go.
So we're back and we got weapons and some nice chunk of change. I don't have to tell them that though. Hey, you're back. You did real well, Mr. Milton. This man can really fight. Save the whole place. Ah. <laughs> don't know how they put out the fires so good. You. Oh, you. <laughs> you saved my life. No need to say nothing, sir. Just doing my job. Now, I don't think they'll be back tonight, but how they will be hey, back. Just in case you stay up. Yep. You see anything or hear anything, you fire that rifle three times. Three times. We'll all come running. We'll do. Uh, well said. And thank you, Mr. Milton. Truly. Just glad to be of service, sir. <laughs> I understand. You get some rest. Thank you, Mr. Geddes. What? What? Ah, uh, she doesn't like him with the gun slinging ways. What choice did I have? Just answer me that. She has no idea. If he went, to do? if he didn't do that, I'd be dead. Straight into Mr. another Jim. mission here, motherhood. Hey. Uh, there's a telegram messenger for you over there in near the house. Oh really? There is. Okay. How does anyone know we're here? What do you think you want? I have no idea. But I doubt someone wants to give me a big pile of money. That's him. I see him. Thanks, Abe. Messenger. Yes, Excuse sir. Me, I'm Jim Milton. Heard you had a telegram for me? Yes. Here. Sign there. Thank you. Huh? Jim, stop. If you're the JM I know, stop. It's Sadie Adler. I've got something to discuss. Oh. Pay good. Meet me in saloon in Valentine. Oh wow. There most days. Stop. Sadie Adler. I'll be damned. Amazing. So sweet to Abigail. Let's go and sweet to Abigail. We need to get some clothes. Where's all my where's all of Arthur's weapons? Do we have to stop earning money and uh, buying all the weapons and upgrading them again? This is awesome, I'm loving it, but I miss Arthur, I want to know, oh, wrong house, I want to know what happened, what exactly happened, you know, doing him to die alone up on that mountain, oh, what's this note now, what's this bloody note, oh. she's going to cause more bloody trouble by running away, Darling John. A kind lady in the village helped me write this. She had men problems of her own, but that's a different story. Listen, I have begged you, but it don't seem to make much difference. I've tried everything I know to make you grow up. And you know I love you, but loving you means I can't watch you do this. Time after time, we've had to run because of your behavior and your decisions. We got a son. I got a son. And I love our son enough that I can't have him around while you're like this. I had so many dreams, John. I hoped you would change. We all saw what happened to them that didn't, but you... Part of you is hell-bent on ending up the same way. And I love you too much to watch that no more. Oh, for fuck's sake. 
took our boy too. <laughs> oh, is it a new shirt? an outfit <clears throat> where's the wife Milton uh, she's out I saw her leaving with the boy and the bags oh what's going on you married mr. Dickens no that don't surprise me what'd she do catch you with a showgirl I hear about you shooting more fellas over by strawberry just who are you Jim Milton I'm a family man I can handle a gun sure them men shot at me. Just interested, that's all. Ain't nothing interesting. Unless you find gossip about a man's marriage worthy of your time. Guess not. There's work to be done. Unless you're running off too. I ain't going nowhere. I'm here to work. Gotta save money, get her what she wants. What does she want? She wants a place of her own. Said she found a plot up at Beecher's Hope. You? A rancher? You'll starve. Probably. <laughs> Keep yourself busy. Take your mind off it. Right, return to work. Don't know what I was doing for a second there. Oh shit. Dangerous getting in there with them beasts. Right. It's milking time. Go. Some fence work. It's awesome this ranch. He wasn't here when we was playing as Arthur a few years earlier. It was just open fields. Yeah, keep the wildlife out. Try to anyway. Few months later, more into the future now. But that's her fool. Hey, you know I was wrong about you. Turned into a fine worker, Jim Milton. Oh, thank you. It means a lot. Hey, you think I could speak with Mr. Geddes? See if maybe he's open to offering me some guidance. No, I'm sure he'd be happy to hear you speak at least. Thank you, Mr. Dickens. Thank you, coin, sir. Go to the Giddy's house. Hmm. I don't believe I've been invited to go and meet Sadie. Just a few months later, um, I hope he responded. Obviously, she thinks he probably never got the telegram, even though it's been signed for. Hey, son. I think that was on the, that the previous Bye, mission. Mr. Milton. Your father in? Can I have a word? Sure. No, I'll just get him. Pa! Hey, I'm right, right here. Hmm. <sighs> What's the problem, Milton? Sorry for the disturbance, sir. Oh, no problem. My wife, she just began her morning discourse on the subject of my faults. An experience I think every man can relate to. In some ways, my wife... My wife also has issues with some of the decisions I've made. Real issues. Do hmm? you believe a man can change, sir? Where is this heading? 
Guess I don't know. <clears throat> I've tried to be a good hand. I've worked hard to secure your property. And for that, we are grateful. And you've paid me well besides. The thing is, I suppose, I need to get a place of my own so I can prove to my wife that I've changed. I understand. But I ain't got much money. I ain't asking to borrow none. But maybe you could go to the bank and oh, put God. in a good word so they could give me a loan. A loan, huh? So I can buy that place, Beecher's Hope? Yes, I know it. Yes, of course, sure. It'd be, it'd be my pleasure. Oh, that's nice of you. Take my advice, Milton. Take your money and go buy passage on a boat. Go to Brazil and forget <laughs> all about family. Bloody hell. I'm just joking, son. Just make sure you deal with Ansel Atherton at the bank. He's a distant cousin. Use my name. Tell him to ask me direct himself. You'll get what you need. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I was young and dumb once, too. <laughs> You'll get her back. What a good lad. That's a wicked case. Let's see what outfit he's got in there. Is it the old Red Dead outfit? The original one. Whee. So that's how he got his hat. It's Arthur's hat. Oh no, no, no. That's his own hat. Sick. Just need to give him a shave, that's all. So it's like we're ready to hit the road. Sweet. But gum wise. Easy there. Yes. This was just mine. Let's see what weapons we got. Yep, we've got all my ammo. Wow, we're out with the varmint. So I've got a. I've got. Yeah, I've got all my. we got Go. Right. Check the map of Rune out. So, is that all we've got? Just one mission to meet Sadie in Valentine. Okay. Where did his family move to again? I have to watch that back. Oh, Blackwater Town. Nice. Nice. So, like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed those videos there, those... Uh, but I like comment subscribe all that jazz if you I'll see you on my next video.